because China has played this game on our culture for the last 20 some odd years, which is they want our psychic insecurities to flourish. They want us to be psychologically insecure. And here's how they do it. Right. The spread of global capitalism in the 1990s was actually their way of accomplishing this, where we fell into this trap that said we were going to export Big Macs and Happy Meals. And Western music was a big part of this, too, to places like China to spread democracy. That was our vision of democratic capitalism in the 1990s. Bipartisan consensus, by the way, Republicans and Democrats alike. What they realized is, oh, wait a minute. We can use these vehicles as a way to actually spread our values back to them. We, we, they thought they could use our money to get them to be more like us. China says, okay, we're going to use access to our market to get America to be more like us. How did that work? What they basically said is you can't enter the Chinese market, be it a music company, a movie company, et cetera. A lot of entertainment fits this description. You can't enter Disney fits this description. The NBA fits this description. You can't enter the Chinese market unless and until you abide by the CCP's way of doing things. But we will roll out the red carpet if you criticize the United States. Yeah. So this idea of self-loathing of – large companies, institutions, entertainment institutions in particular, relentlessly criticizing the United States while actually staying silent about the actual human rights atrocities in places like China. That started in some ways as a form of a psyop, right, by China on the United States to say, we're going to get those institutions that you guys venerate over there, many of them are companies or entertainment providers, to relentlessly criticize the U.S. because the more you do that while also staying quiet in criticism on China, the more they're going to roll out the red carpet for those companies and institutions to be able to expand into the Chinese market, which means more money. Yeah. So, so it is, certainly there was a PSYOP component to this, but that trick only works if we have a culture that's still willing to buy up what they're selling, which goes back to that earlier absence of – purpose and meaning and identity in our culture. 